Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alkali Fantasy here and welcome to episode number 31 of my subsistence Let's Play series. Today, I've been trying to collect the resources I needed to make an indoor grow light. Um, I wanted to have the grow light added to this. So, these vegetables come at a faster rate because now, I did this off camera, I've got a chicken in here. And I've got 90 water, 67 food. So I feel like that'll be good for a little while. There's the hunters up on the hill with the blue light of doom. But yeah, so I wanted to get a grow light. So during the night time, we at least, you know, gain power. I mean, gain, what, what's it called? We fucking can still, we have light, regard, whatever. I know what I was trying to say. It took me a bit, though. My dumb brain to work it out. Okay, so we got everything we need. We just got to wait on having enough power uh, to do that. We'll turn that off. That'll save some juice. All right, so the only thing we've got going is this thing. For now. I'm going to turn that off soon, though. All right, beautiful. So let's get this uh, grow light. Ooh! Dude, that's fucking dope. I like it. And we can reduce the power cost of the grow light by 25%. Well, how much how much power is that going to use? 0 0.07. Fairly expensive. Fairly, fairly, fairly expensive. We'll turn that off for now. And we'll also turn this thing off. Just for now. Put that over there, put that over there, beautiful. Put these back. Alright, awesome. So we got bullets on us. Uh, I wanted to see if I could make the shotgun. So, we need scrap metal and cloth. We don't have enough cloth. Okay. Okay, I'm pretty sure that was the problem I encountered last episode. I just forgot about it. Till just now. So, let's go off and do that then. We've got bullets now to protect us, so that's a good start. Doing it pretty well, I think. Oh, that was a good crate. That was a decent crate. Oh, we got more. We want, I think it's the, the health ones have cloth in them. So we want to find some of those as well. Ammo and the health, health ones are the ones I want to see. The building ones, not so much. Although, I guess we do need computer chips, so I guess I'll take what I can get, but normally I try to go for specific crates. But I don't know how the spawning of the crates exactly works. I don't know whether they they take, you know, half the day to all spawn in, or whether they all spawn in during the night time. Because sometimes I run over the same spot two seconds later and there's a fucking crate there that wasn't there seconds beforehand so it makes me wonder how they spawn like it looks pretty barren at the moment crate wise but really makes me wonder <clears throat> okay let's see it's got to be something around here right no crates at all huh not a fucking thing Wow. I'm very, very upset by this. Alright. So, actually, I discovered the water yesterday in yesterday's video, but I completely forgot that that was an update done like a week and a half ago. I didn't even read the patch notes or anything at the time. I've read them since then. And so, the developer's idea is eventually he wants to make that his own biome and certain resources for certain things will come from that. And apparently there's reeds in... Under the water, so we're gonna have a look quickly. Um, there's meant to be reeds, and apparently you can either use them as a very low substitute vegetable, or you can feed them to your bunnies. So, just gonna wait for our stamina to get up a little bit. Eat the berry. That'll help our stam. All right. So yeah, apparently you can collect these reeds that are under here. 
I assume they're under here. I mean, unless they haven't been implemented yet, but it did say in the update that there was reeds or something you could grab. Which I thought would just be these, but it doesn't seem like I can do anything with them. And I'm drowning. Fucking let me out. Are they talking about these? No. Nah. Yeah, I don't know. They said you could grab some reeds or something. Oh, there we go. Pick kelp. It's kelp. Ah. I seize it now. Okay, that's pretty cool. So what are the properties of the kelp then? Nine veg. I mean, it's not great, but I guess if you were desperate, that would be fantastic. Just go to water and get some kelp, man. It'd be good. Beautiful. All right. Ooh, some shoddy shells. Love it when I get shoddy shells, because it means I don't have to make a bunch later. All we gotta do is focus on getting that fucking cloth, dude. So damn annoying. And seemingly impossible just to find one more cloth. And then the problem is, is if I find another cloth, then I'm not gonna have any cloth for bandages if I need them. Alright, let's try not to get stomped by that bear, preferably. Alright. Well, we're not... I'm not seeing much. Really? Is that a health one? That's with a... No, no, it's just a wolf's head. Fuck's sake. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Oh, yeah, this is bad. Maybe we can flank right up and around. But there was a hunter down there as well. He looks like he's got a combat helmet on, but he has no armor, so I'm thinking about taking him on. The worst part is if I die, I don't know this area of the map. So I'm probably going to have a hard time finding my stuff. But he doesn't seem to be paying any attention. I don't think he knows I'm here. Oh god, there's two. Yeah, this was a bad decision. I need to run. Fuck, I'm gonna die. No. Shit, shit, shit. Oh god, it's gonna be hard to find my body now. Fuck! Fucking cock. Oh, of course. It's going to fuck me even more because I'm not familiar with going from here to where I, my body's at. Shit. I can't lose my gun again. Fuck that. Problem is I'm so not familiar with this area of the map. Like, at all. I think I live on the complete opposite side of this, as well. Which is just fucking terrific, game. Thank you for spawning me about as far as you possibly could. To make it. Oh, fuck. I didn't know where he was. Can we? Nope, not a good idea. Oh shit, he stopped chasing us. Fuck, go. I see a lake, but it's not the lake I'm, I'm wanting. It's not the lake near our house. Fuck. Come on, base beacon. I need you, you fuck. I need to get a reading on where the hell I am. Fuck. Going pretty much the wrong direction. Son of a bitch. Fuck. 
I'm gonna lose my shit again. I'm gonna lose my shit. I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. I'm gonna be so pissed. Come the fuck on. I see all these juicy crates and I can't get them. Mm. And I need to hope the hunter's not camping my body either, otherwise I'm in big trouble. Real fucking assholes. I just want to get a read on where the fuck I am. So I can get back to my stuff. Oh, good. He gave me cloth. Sweet. Alright, the cloth quest is over. Now I just need to get my stuff and I can head back to base. Alright, so I kind of need to get to... ...that side of the map. We're going to go up this way and around that bear if possible. Get over this way. He's somewhat chasing me, so I probably better... Better get my fucking ass and moving, huh? Just want the help with the stam. Fucking stupid. Come on, we gotta get to my stuff or I'm gonna be so pissed. Okay. Okay, at least I know where I'm at. Why wouldn't there be a fucking wolf right there where I wanna go, huh? Why not? I wanna try and follow as closely as I can the trail I went so I know the exact rock I need to look at. This is the part where I'm going to get a bit confused. I think it was up there. Fuck, I hope so. Please let it be. Up here and very obvious to me is what I want. I don't want to be, like, really squinting for it. I know where it's at. Okay, I know where I'm at. Really? Get absolutely fucked. Oh, thank fucking god. Woo! Got it. That is the shit right there, right there. Hell yeah! Oh, man, I was so fucking paranoid I wouldn't remember where my stuff was, but we got it. That's the important thing. And, we still got that one hunter's shit to look at. Probably should drag my bow down here, just in case. Probably should have that out, actually. I couldn't give a fuck about him, honestly. Um... Fuck! Okay. Okay, we're out of here. We're gonna die. Again. Fuck! Right off, dude. Alright, we died in front of the rock this time. Cool. Fantastic. I love it. I don't see my loot box anywhere, though. Oh, yeah, it's in the bush. Oh! Well, that makes it way easier to go get my stuff now. I know exactly where I'm at. And just cut straight down across to the water. And go get our stuff back. Sweet. Fantasticals. Really still want to kill him though. Just a little bit. Give me like four pistol ammo in here. And I'll be really content. Nope. Gave me an arrow though. Man, it just takes too long to make sure you've got the aim on the arrow right and stuff. Which makes you hesitate. 
And then you get fucking shit on. Where's that... Where's that lake? Lockbox there. That I can't open. Because I do not have any lockpicks. They are pretty fucking expensive to make. Alright. I think we'll get our stuff back. If I can figure out where this fucking lake is. Then we'll end off the episode. Oh, there's the lake. Could you just fuck off and leave me alone, please? Right, it's over this way somewhere. I'm trying to like look at the lake as a ga as a gauge on where this shit is. Be actually just over here, right? Somewhere around here. I thought the the hunter's base is or the hunter's little campfire is. Okay, I know where I'm at. Pretty sure. Yeah, I think I'm going the right way. I can hope so. God damn, this episode's been dragged out far too long. I probably should just end it, honestly. Alright guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more subsistence in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Alright, boys.